Here are all the things you didn't know about your pets. Number 12. Positions matter. You probably already know this, but dogs are actually pretty smart. Sometimes it's really difficult to notice, but man's best friend is capable of doing the most astonishing things. Did you know? There is no other species in the world that organizes itself with the environment. What are we talking about here? Yes, believe it or not, dogs align themselves with the Earth's magnetic field when they poop. But why? A dog's sensitivity to the Earth's magnetic field makes them prefer to do their business in a very specific way. A study was conducted in a two-year period with 70 dogs. As the dogs were roaming free, researchers noticed that all dogs would align in the north-south axis right before they do their business. The exact reason why still isn't exactly clear. There hasn't been a way to prove whether it's because dogs can consciously perceive the magnetic field or because they just feel better doing it. Crazy, right? Number 11. Smelling fear. It's a known fact that dogs can be empathetic. They need us as much as we need them. But what's amazing is that dogs can actually perceive emotions in a particular way. Their noses are their center of information. Dogs receive stimuli and process it to know how to behave. And this is exactly what happens when a dog perceives human emotion. They smell it. Dogs are very dependent on their human partner's mood. So when you're happy, your dog can sense it through your smell and act accordingly. When you're scared, your dog can pick up on it and get afraid as well. In one study carried out, participants watched a couple of movies that made them have emotional responses. A sweat sample was taken from each participant. When the dogs were presented with their owner's sweat samples, the emotions the dogs had were consistent with that of the sample. It turns out, dogs respond to the same stimuli and stress that are experienced by humans, especially those who are close to them. Number 10, the best teacher. Cats are pretty much one of the best natural hunters. They are almost nature's perfect hunting machine. And no matter how domesticated they are, they still practice their hunting rituals. It shouldn't come as a surprise to you that all cats do this. But what really baffles cat owners is the fact that they don't really do anything with their prey. When cats catch something, it just seems like they're just showing off, right? Well, there's actually a reason why cats do this. When your cat brings you a mouse, well, it turns out your cat is actually showing you survivor skills. When your cat brings you an animal, they're actually trying to be your teacher. Wild feral cats show their young how to eat and hunt by bringing prey to them. It's a necessary lesson in survival. And that basically shows us what cats think of us. Maybe they think humans are dumb, but maybe not. But hey, at least they're trying to help us out. Number nine, right meow. Cats are independent and have their own personalities, and that means every meow is different. Literally, each type of meow you hear has a different meaning. There's still a mystery surrounding the way cats vocally communicate. While there is no precise number of different meows, cats can make at least 100 different meows. Cats possess at least 10 times more vocal cords than dogs. As their personalities are complex, so are their vocal abilities. Both dogs and cats use different tones to vocalize depending on whose attention they want to get. But when it comes to cats, the range of vocalization seems to be more diverse and points to a richer level of communication. We are in no way saying that dogs aren't good at communicating, but cats seem to have an advantage. The cat's catalog of sounds seem to resonate better with humans. Number 8. No GPS Let's face it, commuting on a train isn't easy for anyone. But that hasn't stopped Russian dogs from using the subway as a way to get wherever they want. Yes, some dogs in Russia are capable of using the subway to get around. They get in line, wait their turn, and get inside trains just like any other Russian citizen. Stray dogs can be found virtually everywhere around Moscow. These dogs have become a staple of the Russian capital. And scientists are pretty fascinated by their wit and intelligence with the civilized way they get around the city. What's even more impressive is the fact that the subway system in Moscow is probably one of the most complicated underground systems in the world. But these dogs seem to master it without any kind of problem. The scientists haven't exactly figured out how some dogs are able to get around, but theories include knowing a station by its scent, recognition of the stop over the loudspeaker, and an ability to judge the time spent on a train. Number seven, check the nose print. 
Sensitivity and perception are key survival traits for any animal. Animals we keep at home aren't that different physically from animals in the wild. Cats' noses are much like their personalities, which is complex. Their noses possess patterns and ridges that make a number of really intricate patterns that are unique to every cat. It's basically the personal distinction each cat has. There are biological traits that are shared among humans, but of course, there's one thing that's very unique for each person, and that's, of course, is our fingerprint. And when it comes to cats, their fingerprint is located right on their nose. Every cat has a different one. No two cats will have the same nose print. Number six, who's the other dog? Jealousy may seem to be an emotion that's exclusive to us, but current studies have shown that that may not be true. While plenty of people experience jealousy, it appears that this is also true for dogs. A group of researchers took it upon themselves to study what kind of reactions dogs may have when their owners don't give them attention they want. Scientists used a stuffed dog that remarkably resembled a real dog. Then they studied the reaction dogs had when the dog's owners displayed affection to the fake dog instead of them. Researchers noticed that more than half of the animals would either touch or push their owner to ask for attention, a clear sign of jealousy. The scientists also tried the same experiment with other objects such as books, but dogs would react much more clearly when their owners interacted with the stuffed animal. Most of them would get between their owner and the stuffed animal, while other dogs went as far as to growl. Dogs are definitely way smarter than we give them credit. Maybe they're evil little geniuses too. Well, definitely not as evil as dolphins, that's for sure. Find out why dolphins are evil geniuses in this video right here. Number five, REM. A lot of studies have delved into understanding how our brains work while we sleep. REM, or rapid eye movement, is the stage where our eyes move rapidly. At this point of sleep, there's intense dreaming and there could also be intense movement. All this happens at various intervals during a regular night of sleep. And this also happens to your dog. Dogs display the same kind of movements humans do while they're in deep sleep. When in a deep sleep, dogs will display rapid eye and limb movement just like humans do. The only exception is that there is also some barking or growling involved. These movements and sounds indicate that they are in fact dreaming. There's no way of knowing what your dog is dreaming of or what makes them react the way they do. But it's definitely noticeable when your dog is in the middle of a dream. Number four, no sweets. Cats are picky by nature, so it's no surprise they're picky when it comes to food as well. Some cats seem to be very specific about what they like to eat. Some people say this isn't true because they hunt whatever they can. But we have to remember that cats don't always eat what they catch, and they also like to hunt for display. While human taste buds are complex and kind of evenly spread, cats aren't the same. Surprisingly, when you let your cat taste your ice cream, their taste buds can't register the sweetness. Scientists discovered that the two necessary genes to preserve sweetness in food weren't fully developed in cats. Since it's just about a lack of sensation in their taste buds, it doesn't mean that they stay away from sweet foods. Of course, they just take advantage of other properties sweet foods may have. Sometimes cats like the food for the texture and smell. Number three, secret sounds. The relationship between dogs and humans has always sparked the creativity of artists in ways that makes us really wonder, what exactly is going on? We know that dogs can hear sounds that we can't hear, but did you know that there's a Beatles song that was specially made for dogs? Well, technically it wasn't a whole song, but a section of a song. At the end of the Beatles song, A Day in the Life, off their Sgt. Pepper's album, there's a high-frequency 15 kilohertz sound put in especially for dogs. That was created by Paul McCartney with the intention of it being heard by his Shetland Sheepdog. Number two, the third eyelid. Our pets came from wild animals, and they're really not that different physically. As wild animals, they develop certain traits that allow them to survive in their environment. Did you know that cats actually have an additional membrane in their eye that's kind of like a windshield wiper? This third eyelid protects the cat's eye from debris or dust. It's a translucent membrane that retracts towards the inner part of the eye. It helps cats keep their eyes moist and their sight in tip-top condition. This eyelid isn't only reserved to cats. Dogs, birds, and many amphibians do as well. However, you'll most likely never see your dog or cat's third eyelid unless you're trying to. The third eyelid can be seen clearly if you gently open your dog or cat's eyes while they're asleep. 
However, if you see their third eyelid while they're awake, that means there's something wrong. You'll want to take them to the vet as soon as you can. Number one, no milk. You would think giving a cat some milk to drink is the right move, but no, it's actually the opposite. Cats are lactose intolerant. While cats may love to have milk, their bodies just are not able to fully process the milk. As kittens, the lactose in milk is very important for their development since it gives them the nutrients they need. But when they reach adulthood, their digestive system just doesn't need lactose anymore. When cats reach a certain age, they stop producing lactase, the necessary enzyme to break down lactose. If an adult cat drinks milk, the lactose starts fermenting in its gut and it basically causes a stomach ache. Not only that, but it can also make things extremely messy on the back end. Watch this next video to find out about animals who are evil geniuses.